Now he's still trying to find the rest of the trash cans. See, I keep saying how that all this stuff would be like a leap of logic for some most people, but back then when this game was made, these games were pretty standard, so maybe it wouldn't be that hard. This it was a leap of logic, but leaps of logic were normal. Yeah. Like the Discworld games. True. Oh. <laughs> Nothing but moon logic. I think I know how to get over there. Let me see. Though, also, a lot of these games came with hint books and stuff, so... Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I gotta go back this way. In fact, And then I'm you surprised. also had the... The toll... The, like, the hell pot lines and shit like that. Yeah. 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 And you, you also had just plain guides, which you would yeah. just fill them by. Yep. They were a lot smaller back in this time, though, I'd imagine. Cause, yes, they yeah. were. I've seen strategy guides for older games. They're tiny. Yep. They're probably the size of, like, a regular book. <laughs> My, my Dark Souls strategy guide, though, it's huge. It's almost as big as my monitor. I had a strategy guide for some Final Fantasy game. It was, like, the size of my hand, like, thick with the thickness-wise. Yeah, like, yeah, like, the guides for, like, 12 and 13 are, like, good. They're, like, big books. Uh, I read a, I read something online that the uh, strategy guide for Fallout New Vegas is apparently bigger than, like, War and Peace or whatever. War, yeah, yeah, I, I've oh. heard that, yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I have an old Majora's Mask strategy guide, and dear lord, it is so big. There's so much to do in that game. It yeah. scares me that people can memorize it. I know how to get... I know how to do pretty much everything in that game. I played it so damn much. Uh, it, I have never played it. Majora's Mask. You really I, do. I tr I've tried before, but stupid ass moon stresses me stresses me out. S stupid ass, shady ass moon and shady ass termina. <laughs> that shady yeah. ass moon and shady ass termina, which is the what country that shady ass um, clock town is in with that shady ass clock tower. <gasps> you are in the boss cubicle area. Oh, the boss is cubicle area, and the boss is in. Be referent. Cheaper, faster, cheaper, faster. Uh, the quip. Alright, fine. <coughs> Use. Boom, a boom, boom. Save again. Talk to boss. Do your job and scram, he bellows in response. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Dick. <clears throat> and he's gone. Oh. And he's okay. gone. Poof, just like that. Put a thermal detonator in his desk. <laughs> All of the desk drawers are locked. However, someone has carelessly left a key card on the desk. Get keyboard. <laughs> you take the key card. Okay. Let's leave. You just take I... his keyboard so he can't use his computer. This? This is mine. <laughs> <laughs> is he looking I'm... for a keyboard? Does his ship... His ship has a computer. It has a keyboard. Why is he wanting another one? Spite? Yeah. Yeah, that seems like Roger. Be because he hates the boss. <clears throat> See... Leon and I have known this guy for so long, we just sort of know what he'll do. Based he, on past experiences. He's key card to open a door, he's probably gonna get killed 6,000 times on the way. Really, it's it's just become a waiting game. See ya, nerds! Honestly, it's kind of like turning into a movie every year. Like, Leon and I get a new job. Roger gets, like, some new adventure thing. He gets a new nemesis. We chase does after him because he does something to us. Goofy stuff happens. So we usually laugh at him for dying. It's it's a thing. Yeah. And then we, then then we just sort of go on our go on with our day. For the next year or so. You hear several clicks. I'm in. You think to yourself. And you hear a synthesized voice say, "Key card verified. Stand by for composite facial scan." So he is. Actually, I don't know. Let's see what happens when. Beep. Your face melts. Composite facial scan complete. 
Access denied. Lame. Use keyboard. Yes, <laughs> picture. Access granted. Hello, Elmo. If only it was that easy. How is the cookie monster today? <sighs> Don't you know? He overdosed. God damn it. <sighs> The janitor doesn't even know how to door. No. I think you might need to do the thing again. Yeah, looks it like closed. it. Let's do, do this. The thing. And 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 this is our great nemesis. Here you're free. That's the two we'll dudes. Fun soon. <laughs> you cautiously enter a darkened chamber. A seemingly bottomless shaft drops off into a black abyss. On a platform in the center of the chamber, the two guys from Andromeda wiggle helplessly in, in lime jello. The platform can only be reached by the four retractable bridges at each entrance. <coughs> Urf, they slurf from, um, from their jello in case captivity. So press. What's these two guys gonna be a lot of fun for you? Press button. We basically get an excuse to shout. I can't shout, because there are people who are outside my door. Well, you don't actually have to, I'm just saying, you know. Okay, so I'm gonna use the vaporizer. Yep. You successfully free the two guys from their slimy con confines, and they begin to speak. <clears throat> Thanks, dude! It's great to be out of that green stuff. Hey, what's your name again? Roger Wilkow. You admit? <laughs> They discovered our distress matches we coded into the Astro Chicken game and set us here as punishment. Let's get out of here before we're discovered. I think we're supposed to, we're supposed to be uh -oh. reading those, actually. Like, reading them in unison, or as close to it as we can get. Uh oh. It's uh -oh. like the two, two, two dudes both talk. Now they're just running. So, what's your plan for getting us out of here, Wilco? <laughs> I was thinking I would... Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey! We won't have to worry about the janitor anymore. I know, right? Elmo. Nobody's going anywhere. <laughs> you must have, th have thought you were pretty clever, Mr. Wilco, disguising yourself as a janitor. That's weird. They're usually there in quotes. And unfortunately for you, my boys are from the Sarix. Had your Sarix used for a ship in the woods. Escort this gentleman to, to the arena. You boys haven't ha haven't seen a good fight in quite a while. <clears throat> and and, and uh, do away with, with, with those two Andromedans. Uh, the, the, they have been more trouble than they were. <clears throat> Take them away. <laughs> totally not cool, dude. I know, I know I'm not cool. That's the point. <laughs> have an aneurysm. He looks like Porky. You and the two guys are separated and, and escorted away. A door opens. You are led into a to the dark and unknown. I can't save it. Should we help them, Leon? The Andromedans or Roger? Mainly Roger, because he, he's our nemesis. I suppose. And if and 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 we can't let anyone else. Okay, Wilco. The name of the ga game is <coughs> Dukem Dukem Robots. Oh, the only <laughs> rule is that there are no rules. Actually, you know what? He's got but this. I Remember, have he can't conveniently die. put put the command for uh, your robot in on the screen uh, in front uh, of you. I f didn't look at them. He can't, <laughs> can't die. Remember? Remember, Mike. He'll be fine. Just watch. <laughs> Doink. Punch. Punch. Do you he's, like this, Wilco? He's gonna have Do to kill you? me because. Huh. <laughs> well, it looks like you depleted your power. The last thing you see is your blood slowly spreading across, across the arena floor. Maybe we should have helped him. Hey, Leon. <laughs> Leon, you should totally short out that guy's power okay. capacity. I had right. to turn on the light. <laughs> I'll just sneak over there and see if I can do that. Better hang out at the gym more often. <laughs> <laughs> How do you like that, Mr. Wilco? So press but button.
I'm actually gonna save it here. Deep Deep. <laughs> right. Zip. 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 Zip up. <clears throat> there. Totally radical, dude. Just said. <laughs> Shut up, I am dude. still evil. You suck, I am not bro. sure how you turned back time, Mr. Wilco. Hey, but man. it will not say. You still have those sticky grenades. When do I not? I'm totally throwing them at that guy's face. Oh, they're stuck to my hand. Hold on. It's good they're on yet. There we go. Can you think you can pull them off without hitting the act without activating them? Uh, yeah. I think no, I'll just rip Sorry, it off. No, no. Just do it quick, like band aid. J and M. Okay, I got it. Oh. Good. Didn't hit the button either. Now throw them quick. J to punch in the block. Doink. Close, though. <clears throat> I think he, when he's walking back and forth, you can just punch him in the face. Yeah. We got pretty good seats up here for an impromptu ticket purchase. Well, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow, yeah. Roger's, Roger's oh, kicking yeah. that guy's ass. Have to do is. do is be able to find a good scalper. Don't Come test on. that's Go, Roger. Kick his ass so we can kick your ass later. I'm not any good at this. In case you haven't can't tell. Well it, it's 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 nukum dukum robots and what do you expect? Well, I'm... figuring that he's able to read your button prompts, I don't think it's that, like, yeah. bad, that you're bad at this, because I think I would be, too. I don't think you can be good at this. Stop and it! He just, yeah, he just reads your button prompts. It's not even funny. It's so not even funny. I think he gets back more energy than you do when you when you hit him. Yeah. Get him into a corner. Suplex, suplex, suplex. Suplex, suplex, suplex. Hey, that that punch didn't count for some reason. You hit him square at the jaw, but it didn't work. Damn it. <clears throat> Aren't obligatory minigames fun? <sighs> yeah. Minigames where the AI just reads your button input. Yeah. Totally fun. So it always knows what you're gonna do. Yeah. See? <laughs> yeah, th this is why games like this shouldn't have boss fights like this. Puzzle bosses. Best bosses. This really isn't much of a puzzle. This is like... That was my point, though. Puzzle bosses are the best bosses. I don't know. Dragon God and Demon Souls is kind of an asshole. Well, you don't want puzzle bosses in that game. I meant... Puzzle bosses are best bosses in reference to a genre like this. In a game like Demon Souls or Dark Souls or even Mass Effect, you'd expect more of a boss than a... Not possible. Yeah.
He gets back so much energy when he hits you. Uh -huh. It's not even funny. Yeah. Just punch him. Punch him. There you <laughs> go. Ouch! He fell right through the floor. Falcon punch. Oh, he like actually power. did it. There. Like the power. Get them, you fools! <clears throat> Get them, you fools! We what do you think I a... pay you for? We better make it fast. Get away! You can make a comic out of this game and Mike and Leon. <laughs> totally, Mike and Leon. That's what we should follow up the Mass Effect Mike and Leon thing with. Comic. Well, Roger, you done good. He managed to rescue the two guys and escape from Pestulon alive. Looks like this will be a milk run from here on out. Gosh, Raj, we really appreciate you saving us. Saving us and all. Dude. 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 Bruh. I like how they're the same person, but one has a beard and one doesn't. One has the uh, LaForge um, visor. Oh. Light speed not functional. Those jokers back on Pestulon must have tampered with the light speed thing in the jig. Why not did the you let thing, him dude. do this to me? I thought you loved me, Roger. So how how do you like the game so far? Was it worth fifty nine ninety five, dude? <laughs> <clears throat> it seems like everyone's everyone explores you. You think they'd be more grateful? Who the hell are you, dude? Hey, we're hungry. We haven't eaten anything but jello for the last few weeks. You have no Warning. idea what Warning. it is. Short-range short fighters, fighters approaching from near rear weapons shift. thingy thingy. Okay, so we want eight. So I think back, I think. Yeah. <sighs> Are you flying the X-wing? I don't know what that is. That's an X-wing, dude. Totally an X-wing. Front. You saw that, right, Astica? Yeah, that's an X-wing. Better than the Y-wing. Cool. Target. Y-wings are decent. Bombers, but that's, that's bad not... fighters. My wings suck. A wings are nice though. A wings. I don't remember how you target. Didn't help. When the enemy ship comes from behind, you will automatically begin tracking. Mm. Use the direction keys or mouse to move the target crosshairs onto the target. When you are locked on, use the spacebar to fire. <clears throat> Back. Yeah. Come on. Do 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 It went right over it. What the hell? Uh, X-Wings are bastards. Yeah. Oops. Damn you, damn you, rebel scum. Oops. Rebel scum. Now it's in back. I had this problem last time, too. Maybe you just have to go to a sector and wait for it to cross. Maybe? Yeah, because it goes right over it and then the thing happens. Well, maybe if you just keep firing, you'll hit it. Well, no, it's supposed to, like, track it. So I don't know what's going on. Shield depleted. So I'm gonna die. 
Come on, you piece of crap. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> yep. With your shield depleted, the final hit shreds the side of your ship. In the sudden vacuum, your body fluids expand beyond the capacity of your tissues. Your desiccated body will drift forever, a grim testament to your blundering stupidity. Waiting, 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 mm. waiting, 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 waiting. <clears throat> would it would it help if you turned on attack like attack speed for your controls? Um six. Let's try that. So there we go. I don't know if that helped or if I just got mm, lucky. No idea. We'll assume luck because luck fixes everything. Mouse works. <laughs> It's almost like this is like built for a mouse. Which is weird, because I could have sworn this is around the time mm -hmm. when mice weren't exactly. Oops! Whew, that was close. Weren't exactly. Maybe with game. attack speed, you're moving fast enough to where it's the, the ship's not like jittering so much. Yeah. So you can lock it. Hey. Hey, buddy. Stop it. Got it. Yeah. So maybe you have to like get the cursor to the middle of that ship and then it'll track. Yeah. Do, 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 do. So if we can get through this, we're pretty much done. Yay. Yay. Are we done? Yay. The remaining enemy ships have given up and are heading back to the planet. It looks like you were just too much for them. Man, oh man, you really showed those bozos a thing or two. Now, can we get something to eat? <laughs> you, inform, you inform the two guys that light speed is no longer functional. They're not overly pleased by this piece of news. What? It's you. <laughs> I'll never get any food. Some rescuer you are. Dude, where's my food? Hey, what's the thing on the wall, dude? It says light speed maintenance access panel, dude. Gee, maybe I can fix this bucket of plasto bolts, brah. Yeah, this is it. This fan belt thing came off the round thing it was on. Just a second, brah. Okay, she's all fixed. Let's go grab a burger, brah. Too late, you realize that you had no course laid in. It light engines kick in before you can override. You inform that the two guys at light speed is not functional, but it's out of control. They're not overly pleased with this bit of news either. Bummer, brah. Ah, we're gonna die. Oh no, why did I have to get up this morning, <laughs> <My brah? baby>. <laughs> <laughs> Careening blindly through space, your ship speeds towards a sizable black hole. Once within the gravitation of the black hole, there's no escape. You plunge into destiny. Onward to destiny, brah! And hey, look, okay, he might have escaped the drifting through space, but there's no way the dad is escaping a black hole. He's out of our, he's out of our, he's not yeah. a problem anymore. Let's go. The overwhelming force of the black hole draws your ship in. Helpless to do anything, you and your passengers strap in and hope for the best. Let's hit the nearest civilized planet and start our next dance club, guys. 
Yeah. You enter a blackness like no other you have ever experienced. All sense of time and speed are lost. Suddenly, a bright light becomes visible in the distance. It grows larger as your ship races towards it. Finally, you are hurled out of the blackness into a parallel universe. <clears throat> you cut the engines to sublight speed to near a seemingly habitable planet. Looks just like Earth. 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 Oh my god, it's Sierra Headquarters. <gasps> oh I my think god. We have not just broken the big fourth wall. wall. We have transcended the fourth wall. In the middle of nowhere. Oh, dude, they've broken into the King's Quest before. This is yeah. a trans I am. Oh, who's this? Allo? It's Allo. It's Ken Williams. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what if? Greetings, Earthling. We are the two guys from Andromeda, universally famous software authors. And I'm Roger Wilco, space age swashbuckler and all around nice guy. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm Ken Woods, president and founder of Sierra Online. So, you two guys are software authors. Ever huh? heard of Astro Chicken, dude? <laughs> no. Good! How, how about you two guys come to work for me? I can. Sounds, Sounds great. great. How, How many buckazoids does it pay, bruh? Buckazoid? Say, uh, Mr. Williams, do you need a janitor? No. No. <laughs> As our space, is, space saga comes to a close, Roger, feeling a little left out, spreads off to his ship with the satisf satisfaction of knowing his mission has been complete, accomplished. Later, dude! The two guys from Andromeda go on to create the Space Quest series of adventure games reaping fame and fortune. They grow fat on their success and soon become burnt out and begin a drunken... I can read that. Drunken something. George, Mike, I feel like the fabric of reality just shifted a little bit. Yeah. I know. And so we bid our hero a fond farewell as his, sh as his ship once again bursts into light speed. I missed ten points somewhere. Huh. Places unknown. Oh well. The end. So, yeah, this one's kind of forgettable, honestly. Thanks to the following for their cooperation making of this game. Uh, I, this is the one I played the most when I was. That's the Department of Forestry. Model Synthetic Industries, Industries Incorporated. It's like this one, <laughs> King's Quest IV, and Quest for Glory. Justice World of Wonders. Are we into the King's Quest series ever? Gipazoid novelties. Huh. Wait, did you do it? I don't remember. Huh? Well, uh, we, we can do it. We should. Leave Hut Sanitizer Council. Yeah. Lead up to the reboot with. Arnoy Droid Works. <laughs> <laughs> Caffeinated. Caffeinated. <laughs> Caffeinated. Orbo Snack Food Inhalers. Inhalers. I think Sync Quest would be fun. We can lead up to the remake with this. Yeah. Friends, Friends of Talking Bear Society. society. <laughs> Oh yeah, because of the talking bear for Sierra. Bob Siebert, Bo Bob Siebenberg, and Stuart Goldstein for their outstanding sound work, bruh. Doug Oldfield, Ken Koch, and Chris Smith for a great programming effort. Bobbit, Bobbit Heatman for his generous yet verbose something. The two, two base man drama to our lives for putting up with these, us for these last 12 months. Oh. And you for showing up hard earned bucks to play this game. <laughs> I think it's just loops. Oh, yeah. 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 Well, that's it. Space Quest 3. Now, 4 is next, right? Yep, 4 is that's next. That's the one where Roger starts actually talking a lot. Yes. Tall. That's yeah. the one that gets all point and click, so. Yeah, that that's one so This closing of the saga wasn't really a closing of the saga. Not really. Not really. <laughs> Though. <laughs> the way it seems, it might, Leon, Mike, and George might have to have a slightly lesser role since they'll be doing a lot of talking as, uh, Roger. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh well, we can figure it out. It's okay, they have three full games of Reaper Killing to get through anyways. <laughs> yeah. 
We hope yeah. everybody enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Bye. 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 Bye.